Hey everyone, it's Joe from Great Product Reviews. Um, I have an interesting tidbit to share with you guys today. Um, this one is related to uh, any external device that you plug in, external memory, like an SD card or a thumb drive or an external hard drive. Um, this is for you guys who have any of those devices. I want to share something with you guys today. Okay, so currently I have right here an SD card from my camera connected to my uh, MacBook Pro. And as you can see over here, there's a bunch of images. And what I want to do is I want to delete everything off the SD card from here. Most of the information is obviously the images. And I want to delete those. But sometimes when you delete images or when you delete files from your external device and then you eject it, your device doesn't realize that it's been deleted. And I'm, I'm going to demonstrate that for you guys today. So first let's do a get info and let's take a note here that it says capacity is 31.9. That's about a 32. It's a 32 gigs and available is 28.07 gigs. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight all my images and I'm going to hit command delete, which moves everything to the trash, 409 items to the trash. We'll just let that go. Okay. So now it's empty. There's, there's this small little file here that's only four kilobytes, nothing in this folder, nothing in this miscellaneous folder. So we should have, when we get get, get info, we should have 31.9 uh, capacity and available almost 31.9. But as you can see here, it still says 28.07. Okay, I'm, and if you... If you were to eject it, I'm going to eject it right now. If you eject it, okay, I'm ejecting it and I'm going to put it back in the laptop, open it again, just make it full screen over here. Nope, don't need photos. Okay, same thing, it's empty still empty when you get get when you go to get info it's the same thing it says available 28.07 and I ran into this recently and I was like hey what's going on why does it say only 28.07 when I deleted everything well here's the problem guys and this is interesting that I, this is something that I just recently discovered and found it quite interesting you actually have to clear your trash folder for while it's plugged in, so while your device is plugged in, whether it be an SD card, whether it be a thumb drive, or an external hard drive, what you have to do after you delete files is you have to go into the trash and you have to empty the trash. When you empty the trash, see what just happened? Now I have available 31.94 gigabytes. Now it makes now it actually makes sense to reality, which is what I did. I deleted it. But for some reason, when you delete something, and I, I don't know if this is the same for PC, but on the Mac, when you delete something, it goes into the trash folder. Even if it's an external device, it still thinks that those files are existing on the device. And the device will still say that, that it's being occupied by those files. So anyway, I hope you guys got something out of this. Uh, I, I definitely, you know, when I discovered it, I was, wow, like, oh my gosh, I have to share this information. So that's how you do it. Now I can put it in my camera and it'll show full memory again. Before, if I had put it in my camera without going into the trash, it would have actually said that there was only 28 gigabytes available. And normally what I've been doing is I just reformat it on my camera, but I don't understand. I didn't understand why I had to do that. And now I understand. So I hope you guys got something out of this. Um, if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Um, feel free to subscribe. Uh, the more subscribers, the better. I love having more people uh, coming and watching my videos, giving me their comments and feedback. And if you like this video, uh, give me a thumbs up. And uh, I appreciate you guys. And thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. You guys, take it easy and have a great day. Bye.